Welcome back to the Horse City career mode. Today we're going to be making some signings in this video and basically in the comment section from yesterday's video it's been decided that we are going to go for Joe Hart as our number one goalkeeper. Looking at this we might have to pay at least five million to be able to afford him, to get him even. Also to bring back Eldin Jakubovic. Now Still looking at the um, they're still being scouted, but I added a few people to the 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 shortlist as it were. Now we need a striker, so I've gone for Adam Ida from Norwich, a very good youth talent, as well as Jana Fete Arp from ba Bayern Munich. Our left back situation isn't the greatest, so I've added Rico Henry, um, Jada Silva, Anthony Robinson, and Josh Tymon, who used to play for Hull. We want to look at one of the more sort of uh, better options in the championship who will be good for this standard immediately. Uh, Rico Henry is one of those. He's very, very quick. The Silver, another quick fullback. Um, both of them 21. It just depends who we want to go for, who's going to be cheaper. He's just joined, so we might not be able to get him. And then Anthony Robertson. Looks like we can't get him, so it's between Rico Henry and Josh Tymon. Right, so it looks like we didn't get out of the group stage. We had a 1-0 loss in the first game. In the second game, a 2-0 loss. And in the third game, a 4-0 loss. So we conceded seven goals in three games. Got some offers. Um, captaincy, Johnny Device, okay. Um, Kev Stewart, John Toro, okay. Um, Ritson and Kingsley. So three of them we want to sell. Uh, we don't want to sell Kev Stewart, so we're going to just block that completely. Kingsley to... Um, Chinese league and um, we're just going to accept these Ritson to wherever that is. I've no idea where that is We'll just accept these Toral as well 900k right so we've got some more scout reports back Josh Tymon, Jada Silver, Rico Henry, Adam Ida That guy, that guy, that guy, Alden, Bailey, Aaron, David, David Bentley. Right, let's go in for Joe Hart right now And try and get him Right, so here we go in the office um, with the Burnley rep, with Sean Dutch. I think so, I think it's him. We're going to go ahead and offer, we don't want to pay 3.6 million for a 32 year, old goal, two, 32 year old goalkeeper. Put that and we might try and cheat the system and put a sell on clause. Right, 3 million, slightly, slightly better. We can drop 2.8 with that sell on clause. And he's happy, he's happy. And we're going to go ahead and go straight into the negotiations into the negotiations for the contract we go current range is 21,000 we're going to say he's crucial because he is crucial 75 rated will be our best goalkeeper in the side um, contract wise two years I believe will be just enough um, hopefully he's willing to take a page cut to come to the championship um, if he's not then I don't know right they haven't given us one He's taking a 6,000 wage cut and we could add something here. 20,000, would that, is that enough? 50,000 signing bonus, see if he takes that. And he has, right, signed Joe Hart and he has joined Hull City. So we're going to go ahead and put him straight into that starting goalkeeper spot um, over Ingram and George Long, unfortunately. If we sell both of these, we can probably get about a million. Next, we are going to go for Eldin. We're going to look to bring him back. He's going to be our backup. Um, he's going to be about our backup, yeah. We're going to try and move the other three on, um, if we can. We, could, we can get Eldin for quite cheap. Eldin will play in cup games, hopefully, until, he's, until he's, he's, his overall's straight down. But yeah, here we go. We're going to try and sign Eldin right here, right now. Um, 250k. Is enough for Leicester. Hopefully we can get him to sign right here. Sporadic, that's fine. One year, we'll just bump it up to two years. Just just because why not? We want to try and get him to retire here at the club. Disregard, he's on 12,000. We'll just drop that to 10,000. And with Joe Hart, we gave him 50. So we'll give Aiden, Aiden Eldin the 30,000. And he's happy with that. We brought Eldin Jakubovic back to Hull City. The big thing here, guys, is we've bought two pretty old goalkeepers in Joe Hart and in Eldin. Eldin's 34, Joe Hart's about 32. Yeah. Um, Joe Hart's not going to be good enough for the Premier League. Neither's Eldin. 
So let me know in the comments section down below what goalkeeper was, what young goalkeepers you want me to go out and buy maybe January and maybe start a next season for the Premier League. But for now, I'm happy with those two signings. Let's try and make some more. Right, so some news here. We've sold Stephen Kingsley and we stole, sold John Torrell and we've got an offer for George Long. 900k from Rio Ave FC. Straight away, just going to sell him. We've got a transfer offer from Tranmere um, for Will Mannion, um, the young goalkeeper, 21 years of age. He's not in my plans. He probably won't be in my plans for the future, so we're going to go ahead and sell him as well. We've had nothing in terms of transfer offers for Tom Eaves, um, McGuinness or Norbert Baller. So what I'm going to try and do is it's, it's going to be a bit cheeky. When going for Adam Ida, I'm going to try and offload one of those three on Norwich. Here we go. One million they want. I'm going to go for a player swap. Strikers. I'll give them Norbert. They're about the same valuation. They don't want Norbert. They want a goalkeeper, centre half, and a winger. We're just going to have to offer a transfer fee. We'll go with his valuation of one million. Hopefully that works. He wants an extra 50k. More than fine. We're going to get the negotiations kicked off. Um, here we go. Current wage fourth. Okay. What's he? What's he want to be? We'll put him in. Oh, I was supposed to go. Important, but crucial's fine. Crucial's fine. Um, rolling it, locking down for five years if we can. Wonderful. Um, for someone like Ida, he's going to be a talisman. Um, so, oh my god, he wants to take a, a 2k wage cut. I'm just going to give him that. Now, in terms of left back, we've got two to choose for Rico Henry or Josh Tymon. So, I'm going to go with 22 year old. He's just turned 22, Rico Henry. Let's see if we can get him. So once again, we're going to try and offload one of our shitty strikers on him. We're going to go, oh my god. If they say yes, oh, I nearly gave them Ida. <laughs> Thank god they said no to what? Imagine saying no to Ida. Right, we're going to go ahead and do 200 below his valuation. They want 5 million. And that's going against our unspent transfer allocations. This could be... <laughs> They do not want to reduce the price any further. Okay. Uh, yeah. The minimum they're going to go is 5 million, and I'm not comfortable with spending that much on a 22 year old. He's, he's good, though. Right. We're going to leave it at that. Now, I would go in for Josh Tamman, but like I just said, we don't want to because he was a twat to the City fans. Um. These two we can't get at the moment, so I'm going to try and find a left back we can buy. So a bit more news coming through. We have finally sold Will Mannion and um, George Long. They are both out of the club. That puts our, our transfer budget up to 8.3 million. So with the first game of the championship nearing in four days, I'm going to go ahead and try and make just a few more signings before this opener of the championship season. I've added a few more people to the transfer um list the transfer list the transfer um short list here we've got Mikhail Mika michael obafemi from southampton he's got a release clause of 3.5 million though which we might not be able to afford we could maybe get him for around 2 million if we're lucky james justin 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 who's just joined um leicester i was going to try and loan him but don't look like we can loan him um tino Angerin. he made his debut for chelsea before the league the league was um stopped Maybe in the future. Um, Todd Kane, who was at Hull City last season, um, he can play right back. It says he can play right mid back, but he can play left back and left mid as well. That's where we had him playing for us. In terms of a left back, we've got Dominic Thompson, who looks like he's just joined those. And Omar Richards um, of Reading. Hopefully we can get these scout reports in um, by the time we play Swansea. If not, not the end of the world. We'll just have to wait until after we played Swansea. So I thought with the increase in funds from the sales of Manny and George Long, I'm going to go ahead and try and get Rico Henry. He's a really good left back um, for 22 years of age in the championship. 72 rated is good. He'll go in instead of Callum Elder, who will become our backup. I'm going to put his, his valuation. 4.3 million. I might just take that and run. I'm going to take that and just... 
out of there. Can we sign him before this Swansea game? It's the day of the Swansea game, so he's going to be playing if we can get him right here. He's going to be crucial. He's going to just go straight into that left-back role. Great, wonderful. Um, how long does he want to sign? Five years, hopefully. Three years, fair enough. We'll accept that. Once again, I'm going to um, get rid of the bonus. Put a few more bits of cash in his back pocket. We've got him. We've got him in the club. Right, guys. So this is where I'm going to leave the episode. I'm. We've got the starting eleven sorted, I believe. Um, Joe Hart in goal. Uh, two centre halves. Johnny Device, who's going to be the captain for this season, and Reese Burke. Lee High and Henry in the fullback positions. Jackson Irvine and Kev Stewart CDMs. Right wing, we've got Martin Samuelson. Left mid, uh, Malik Wilkes. Down the middle, hopefully going to be a really big player for us this season. Marcus Madison. And then Adam Ida leading the line by himself. If there's any changes you want me to make to this side, um, whether it be Leo Lopez in for Stewart, uh, we start a different centre half instead of Burke or Device. Uh, maybe we start Eldin. <laughs> um, then let me know in the comment section down below. Um, also, I've identified that we need we need a young right back. Lee is in is thirty, and he's sixty nine. So his starts gonna start. His starts. His stats are gonna start dropping. Um, and I don't think Robbie uh, McKenzie will really be good enough. Might need a right back as well as a young goalkeeper. So leave your your thoughts in the comment section down below. And also. Um, how many games do you want to see in an episode? Do you want to see three? Do you want to see four? Do you want to see five? Leave it in the comment section down below. And yeah, guys, I will see you in my next video. Like and subscribe, and I'll see you later.